The new Embraced Identity Sniper Rifle is insane. This sniper rifle might be one of my new favorite snipers in Destiny so far. Anyways guys, my name is Hectic. In today's video, we'll be covering the new Embraced Identity Sniper Rifle. The role we're walking in today's video is Opening Shot and Precision Instrument. I've been farming this for a decent amount of time. I haven't gotten a great roll, but uh, this has been the best one I've gotten so far. We're going to be using Rose. Now, for people running uh, mags, arrowhead break, steady rounds with a targeting adjuster. This thing is a adaptive frame, and it is a 90 RPM. Anyways, guys, I'll see you when we get into the game. Alrighty, guys, here we are. I'm gonna grab this special. Oh, dude, I forgot how bad they nerfed sniper flinch, man. You get flinch in this guy so fast. I'm kind of weak. I'm just gonna sit back for a minute. Nice little cleanup. There's someone. I'm getting pushed from like every lane right now. I think the big thing too with the sniper is you just have to get an open angle where you're not being shot at. The scope kind of reminds me of Borealis. My big thing with the sniper that I just really, really don't like is how big the reticle is. I feel like it actually throws me off. But uh, opening shot makes this thing so much more crispier. Like, look at that. I mean, obviously, I'm naturally decent at aiming for the head, but, like, I wouldn't usually hit these shots without an opening shot. You can just hear the perk proc itself. We are doing rumble, just for anyone. Right? There's going to be someone right behind me. I'm definitely going to get pinched here, yeah. That's unfortunate. I, I was low-key kind of hoping we'd, like, be able to play a lane there, but definitely not. Okay, this guy is heavy. And then we're getting shot right from behind here. Dude, oh my gosh, man. Oh, well, we're dead. And us, you know. Man, I feel like every gunfight I'm just sandwiched and pinched on this map, dude. My That's my big thing about doing these videos. Like, let's make you some right. They are just, that's brutal. Oh, that would have been, okay, if that was pre-nerf, that would have been a headshot right there. That's unfortunate. There we go. Opening shot like slows it on the head and makes it like magnetize. It's such a weird perk, but it works so well. Obviously, that's a bit of aim assist too. This thing does have pretty high aim assist. That's one thing we cannot deny. Oh, I'm gonna push the back right here. This guy's sitting on that staircase. Oof. We are actually down by one kill here. Let's try and tie that back. Dude, everybody keeps pushing this one guy, man. I don't know. Okay, I, that is insane. I don't know how that did not hit. Strand clones need to be nerfed, bro. Hopefully. Okay, now we're grabbing heavy. I think, like, three things that just drive me nuts about Rumble is just heavy ability spam. I mean, I guess that's, like, everywhere, but, like, you know what I mean. And autos, autos are really annoying. Okay, I have to get my health back here. This guy's pushing to the side. Hopefully my clone hits him, maybe. Clone, detonate. All right, well, we got to clean up kill the rows. Holy man. Like, look at that drag you get on that sniper. Like, I'm just using a controller right now for anyone wondering. I just play on a PS5. There we go. Can we finish this with a third clean? Maybe a quick scope? Quick scope action? Definitely not. My ADS is a little bit too slow. I, I'm not a fan of the zoom, though. Yeah, we definitely are not getting that sniper kill. <laughs> I honestly should have just killed that guy before. Knew he was going to get that kill. Did people stop running into this one guy, bro? This uh, Supremacy Storm guy is going to win just off people just running into him, bro. Dude, where is everyone at in this lobby? This guy's getting all the kills. I've died like twice. Dude. Oh my gosh, man. There we go. Alright, well, we cannot let this guy get a single kill. Is it going to happen? Probably not. If this guy jumps off the map, bro. I feel like that's definitely something our Toxic Rumble player would do. I'm assuming the Supremacy guy spawned right behind me, yeah. He really just spawns on this map. Okay, okay, bro. Come on. Oh my gosh, one wrong move and it's over. No way, no way I survived this. No way, get away, get away. Bro, 
I'm just crazy. Oh, well. He's transcendent. That's unfortunate. Please, please kill this guy. Please. If he, if this guy kills this guy somehow, bro, I might be able to win this. I, I don't think he's doing it. I just have to not let this guy get heavy. Off. Oh, I hit that body shot. Nice little cleanup kill. I love these close rumble games, but man, that supremacy storm guy just had everybody running into him. I wish I'd do that to me. Oh, well, I just lost the game. That's unfortunate. Okay. Well, we don't have to teabag, man. Yeah, GG's. That was a really fun rumble game. We got some nice kills on the sniper. It's overall pretty good. I would highly recommend to use this thing. Uh, the roll snap opening, of course. Oh, we played better than him. Well, GG's. Anyways, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Have a great night. Stay safe. Thanks for watching. As always, peace. Guardians, I would like to recommend you a fantastic service. To Bing.net, you can find teams to complete different activities like raids, dungeons, Charles of Osiris, exotic farming, and many more endgame activities. The best part about the service is it does not require you to share your account information whatsoever. You don't need to give your login or password to order a service that you like. All you have to do is select the self play option. To do this, select something you like. In this case, I'll do pro design. You're going to choose your clear option. I'll be doing the full clear, so click full clear. Then select the self play option. As you can see right now, we have $25. To get a discount, make sure you type in code hectic for a 15% discount here. As we can see right now, our total is $25.05. If we apply this coupon, we get $24, so you save a dollar. I would highly advise doing this. From here, you're going to choose a payment method. There's Visa, PayPal, and a few other payment options. In this case, we'll be using Visa. From here, agree to the terms and services, and then proceed to checkout. I would highly recommend Nimming.net, especially because the funnel shape is releasing and there's many awesome services that can be done. That's all for today, guys. I'll see you in the next one.